All right, guys, today is the day that I'm finally gonna start building the RC car track, so let's get to it. But all right, guys, yeah, like, so I'm not gonna start off with anything kind of special, just basically cutting the pattern in the grass and then putting jumps up and just kind of doing that. But just kind of going at this, I really didn't make a plan or anything. But there was this big dip, like right here. <laughs> Can't really see it because the grass. This is a pretty big dip. So I figured this would be a cool turn. So this is where I started. <laughs> just kind of left the. So you go on the inside, you'd be nice, smooth, maybe something fast and kind of sweeping. So, so that's where we start. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna cut the grass down. I let it kind of grow up a little bit and cut it high last time. So I'm gonna cut it down pretty low with my riding mower and then go back with the push mower and just like drag it on the ground and just cut the grass as low as I can possibly get it. But I don't think I'm gonna put any barriers up. I just like the idea of like building it like this, putting a few obstacles out here. That way, if I want to change the track up, it's just cutting the pattern different in the grass. <laughs> but you know, have like, you know, a big triple and like a big tabletop and stuff like that. Yeah, and just change it up by like cutting a different design in the grass. <laughs> but as the cars run over it, I'm sure the fast line will be nice and clean and the rest of the track will be have like little stubby grass in it and stuff so yeah anyway i'm hoping to get the majority of this knocked out before it gets dark but if not i will show you guys the end result tomorrow and i'm just gonna finish <laughs> finish cut my little track out stuff like that one thing i've noticed is that the track is gonna be extremely long but not very wide and most rc car tracks are not very long but kind of wide you know so oh well i don't think it's really gonna matter but you know it is what it is <laughs> all right let's get this thing knocked out guys well that was pretty much a lap of the track um you now you might be thinking like man it sure doesn't look like a lot well it's not it's just a pattern cut out grass <laughs> but you know nothing is anything until someone makes it something i think this is a pretty good start though um this is really the only place where i kind of kind of lost the plot i was really hoping to have like I don't know enough speed and something to make like a really big jump but i'm kind of suspect that this might be a bit of a problem because it's the track is going to be really deep and maybe less less i move like the driver stand to like the side of it or something because like so right now it's a really long track <laughs> so um i think you know it's gonna make it kind of weird when you're trying to jump you're jumping away from you or something like that i don't know but we'll see worst case scenario be like you know some a change from like the normal track design <laughs> but yeah we'll figure it out like i said that's the kind of the beauty of this being cut in grass because if the layout sucks or i don't like it i just 
you know, let the grass grow up and then just cut a new design. <laughs> But yeah, I, I don't even really know how wide it is. I'm sh I know in some in some sections it's a little bit wider. I was trying to keep it like one turn in the radius of my mower <laughs> wide, but I'm kind of pumped though. And I think it's kind of cool. It has some like this right here is kind of like off camber, so you come around this turn, which you got all this room to build up speed, so you have to slow down because you'll have a tendency to roll right here. So it has some natural stuff that should be kind of fun but you got to figure out how to work in like some jumps and stuff because see like here's a straight but i don't know if you would see it because the jumps here you know most rc car jumps you're jumping from the side view so that might be a problem so i don't i don't know about that so we'll have to see and i built this little that little spot right here so I might put the driver stand right here. So you'd be kind of like looking at it this way, which kind of makes more sense. So it's not gonna be a big driver stand, like I said, and it won't be a far, it's just you're not really in the center of the track. So like I said, I got some thinking to do. Um, it definitely makes more sense to have the driver stand here. So we'll have to see. I don't want to like start building stuff and then like you know you, you can't drive it but i left enough room right here just in case i could put the driver stand right here and it could still cut through and have like a small pit lane or something i don't know but this definitely makes more sense to have the side view of the track instead of like being at the you know long end of it whatever you want to say but yeah i'm pumped about it like i said uh i bring the electric car out here and just kind of run it around and kind of see you know how everything how it's all going to work out and i said that that's the only part of the track that bumps me i was like right here <laughs> you kind of say i lost the plot like i was going to like try to make it come up a little bit but kind of ran out of space that's like 10 foot wide probably long run out like 12 or something i don't know so yeah but yeah like i said just let the grass grow up and when i cut it again i can kind of work it in there yeah my backyard for whatever reason though is like it's really like not very level so makes for it's not gonna be like a flat track without me putting a lot of dirt out here but yeah once i get the track design done you know kind of run it a few times and figure out what's going to work better then i can get some dirt out here and uh start getting some jumps built all right guys that's enough of me rambling um if you're interested in seeing more of the track stuff just let me know in the comments stuff like that you know this is like my winter projects i don't expect this to get done like overnight but like i said as i run I, I mean i got time so it's no rush i can just i say run my car around a little bit figure out where the best place for the driver stand would be and all that all that stuff and i can even well i'm kind of stupid how to turn around but yeah We'll figure it out. <laughs> Be like, so this is my winter project, so I'm in no rush for it. So we got plenty of time. But all right, guys, appreciate you watching, sticking around, and uh, we'll see you on the next one. Right, we're gonna try to make it into a big jump. We'll see. <laughs>